hello everyone welcome to google forms tutorials in this video we are going to see that how can we handle the charts that are created in google forms with the responses so whenever any person responds to our google form if we have these questions like multiple choice questions or a radio button questions or a checkbox questions then google forms automatically creates a chart for us to better understand the options like here there is only one response and one person has chosen february if there are hundreds of responses then instead of going through all of these options it would be easier for us to look at this pie chart and understand the sentiments of the people that what option they want the most like which is the most popular option right so for this purpose google form automatically creates these uh, kind of a charts for us like this pie chart this column chart this again pie chart for the list then uh, for this rating we have this kind of a bar chart again this bar chart for these option questions uh, for both of them okay so what happens now is we have this copy option given in each of these charts as you can see in the normal response we do not have this copy option but in these charts we have this copy option now why is it used it is used because these charts can be directly copied and used in the business intelligence tools like power bi tableau or can be directly integrated into our presentations like if we want the responses of the users to be summed up and shown in a presentation we don't have to like take a screenshot or maybe take the responses individually load them into an excel sheet and then um, load them into the powerpoint presentation to create a chart or something like this no we can simply just copy it from here and paste it into our ppt so how do we do that simply just click on this copy go to any of these softwares uh, right now i have opened word and here what we can do is simply just press ctrl v to paste it simply if you want some other chart let's just go again copy this go to word ppd or any of the softwares and control v to paste it so by this we can get an offline copy as well we can show it to others we can use in the analysis part as well to understand the sentiments of the people that's it for this video thanks for watching